Hey everybody, this is Ben, and welcome back to Timber and Stone. Oh man, the the village slash castle is coming along very nicely. Um, got this little platform out here for where some new farming is going to be taking place. Uh, it's looking quite good. I'm thinking I might want to just extend this over this way and make this whole section farming, but that will probably come later. I will leave it mostly empty, though, I think, for the time being. And I'm also, uh, I got a whole bunch of people. I just kind of switched almost everybody over to be um, mining. <laughs> um, oh, can someone reach this? I hope someone can reach that. I think someone can. I don't want to leave little bits of materials hanging around. Uh, oh, another merchant. Yay. Um, everybody's getting very crowded in there, but they've been working hard all night. Someone's gonna get that, right? Yeah. Someone will get that. It's fine. Oh, you, you, hey, you, what, who? Rising fate, get your butt. Get that, get that. Ah, maybe they can't reach it. Well, in that case, I might leave it there. <laughs> um, so oh, there's a trader coming along that way. So what we've got is, I'm thinking I'm gonna put like a timber wall around here maybe still not a hundred percent um we, let's see overnight i got hit you know a couple of spiders nothing major haven't seen anything big in a while and that leaves me a little bit wondering um but yeah otherwise things look great uh food is on its way up and my blacksmith, Dorothy, here has been quite busy. Got her busy making some nice, sweet pickaxes for everyone there. So I think everybody pretty much has like a sharp pickaxe. Yeah, very nice. 8% bonus on stuff. Oh, these can be upgraded. That's cool. Uh, oh, masonry is 2,500 of 3,300, but it's filling up. It is getting there. Very nice. Uh, let's see if I have anything else inside that I can... Yeah, misery. Sure, let's upgrade that one. Make all these suckers in here upgraded as much as I can. Huh, why has that not been done? Okay, that's good, that's good. Okay, huh. Interesting. Anyway. So, um, yeah, we're, we're getting down to the next level, and I cut it all the way down to there. This landing is going to be the, uh, the next level. I think I'm going to cut these stairs back a little ways, probably. I could, I'll leave them for now, but uh, as I uh, finalize the road more, I think I definitely want to cut that back. Um, and then, ah, uh, yeah, not a lot else to report in the immediate uh, vicinity. Wade, holy cow, he's carrying 50 stone. <laughs> Why do you have a stone pick, man? Do I need to make another sharp pick? Still sitting good on solid ingots and stuff, yeah. All right. Oh, look at that pile, whoo! That provides 1,500, that's crazy. All right, let's check out, yeah, I got one down here. Upgrade that. Are these upgraded? Yes, is that upgraded? Yes. Oh, and I made an ingot stack down here. I wanted to check it out. Uh, you can make a minecart for uh, metal storage or an ingot stack, and the ingot stack always seemed really expensive to me, but in the end, the minecart fully upgraded provides 40 storage, and the ingot stack fully upgraded provides 60 storage, so it's 50% more storage. So if, you know, space is a concern, then it's pretty pretty well like a no-brainer, I think, to go with the, the ingot stacks. Oh, there we go, uh, what, uh, uh, Rebecca. Rebecca Reinhardt, who is just my interim builder. She is finishing up. Um, oh, she I think she killed this spider. Sure, gather resources off that sucker. And I, she's going to fill in all of, let's see, stone. Okay, we got some new holes here. Great. Looking pretty great. So at this point, we are still just waiting on the digging, but things are taking shape in a very serious way here. Um, what I'm gonna do, where's Rebecca Reinhardt? 
are you walking out there? Are you walking in here? Let's just find her the easy way. <laughs> oh, there she goes. She is headed over there to build that stuff. All right, as soon as she's done, I'm gonna send her to do some wood chopping. And then she should, uh, cause I'm gonna need a little bit more, I think to build up my wall around the farm stuff. And you're good. And you're there, independently chopped nearest. Sounds good. Uh, we can get rid of chop down sapling. Sure, and remove this. Yeah, remove this dump. All right, fine, 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 fine. Okay. So, look at that pit. No one can reach that stupid piece of coal. Dang it. I better uh, mark these off real quick. Guys, come on. No, no, no. Yes, no. Get that one. Ugh. Wait, come on, what level? Oh, you're only level four minor. My my mistake, Elizabeth Scott, you're level nine. Get your, no, don't dig out that one, you need to stand there. Wow, they are not very smart. Uh, I guess I need to do this in smaller chunks just to make sure they can reach stuff. Oh, is he? He's getting it. All right. Rising fates, of course. Thank you. So in here... Um, wait, where did Rebecca go now? There... Chopping down an invisible tree. Well done. Did you get, you got some wood from that invisible tree. <laughs> oh, it was, oh, I bet you that was that burnt down tree. That's what that was. All right, weird. That worked weirdly. Dig mine, dig. Just leave that for now. Maybe I can get at that by like digging out something here. Actually, I'll just, never mind. I should leave that mark just in case someone can reach it. And so yeah, we started going around this side also. They are just finishing that up. So I think what I'm gonna do is here. No, 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 no. Dig out that way. Just like that. Sure, we'll leave that there. Great. They'll make quick work of this. Now everybody with a massive pickaxe, those things are so huge. Uh, all right, where's Brunhilde? Brunhilde, uh, it is time to check out the map. I'm gonna bring it all down to just grayness, dead spider. Spider appears to be in good health. Oh, good, good for him. No, I'm not interested in the tree. Um, yeah, yeah, the resources. So we've got a fair number of spiders. Yeah, a good number of spiders out here. We're gonna have to clear these out again. Sheep or chicken? Chicken. Yeah, all I've gotten lately is spiders. That's a, just a dead skeleton over there. Nothing over here at all. Man, just one spider there. And I think that is a dead wolf. Well, I guess I am just too strong. No one wants to attack anymore. Good problem to have. Okay, so that way. that look there just finishing that so 
let's actually why did that not go yeah I missed a row there oops all right so we're actually gonna go this way here we go chop all that down guys gonna have to move these stockpiles obviously so yeah this is uh, another reach another point here where the episode's not especially exciting um i've got a couple of pretty good pretty well trained infantry i've got uh a big group of miners uh, my food is fairly stable i guess i could i can designate that stuff let's do that let's set up some farms um design farms all right what does everyone like to eat carrots and potatoes carrots potatoes and i want to make these like sizable so i don't have to keep fiddling with them um so let's do like five by five yes five by five there and what was that carrots <laughs> um i forget what i just did carrot farm okay <laughs> I forgot which one I picked right. And we're going to go with potatoes. Five by five. There we go. Carrots and potatoes. Uh, oh, I'm going to need like a food barrel down there or something. Objects. Storage. Food. Fish rack. Food and seed. So food barrel should provide enough for provide both for that. Why can't I put it there? That's super weird. I don't know. I can put it there though. Which is probably good. Put one there. Cool. For convenience. Carpenter. I doubt I have a carpenter. Uh Carpenter. Wade. Quit mining for a little bit and build that up. Oh, everybody's going to sleep, aren't you? Yep, bunks are all filled up. <laughs> I am just terraforming the heck out of this hill now. <laughs> That's how you do it, though, right? Civilization and stuff. Where are you going, Rebecca? wood isn't there a wood oh i need to move the wood stockpile ah figures okay we need storage for miscellaneous which i think i was just hiding in here <laughs> and with that um yeah i think all is well miscellaneous resource crate let's just uh i mean these are Three timber? Yeah, level two carpenter, pretty dang cheap. Let's just make a bunch. Oh, I wish I could stack the crates. That would look pretty nice. One at a time, of course, of course. Oh, now it's tools. Can I destroy some tools or something? I certainly don't need to keep very many Oh, I should make some strong tongs. Yeah. Let's do that. And these I can bring down to just one. Stone hammer, one. Shears. Sharp shears, even. Let's add one of those. And the shears, I can just, yeah, leave one. That's fine. All these things. I can make strong ingots now, so I don't need to... Why are there five knives? <laughs> okay, cloth, fat, and wood. Let's maintain five of those in storage, just for fun. Uh, I have a strong hammer. Sitting there. Great. Sharp picks. Sitting there. Sharp axe. Let's see. Stone picks. One. Stone axe. One. Sharp axe. I'm gonna just make one. 
strong fishing rod. Very interesting. I don't have any water, so I'm not going to bother with that. And a strong hoe. Yeah, cool. And it's getting dark. So, man, I managed to rattle on until it got dark on this episode. Though I did start a little later in the day, I guess. But thanks so much, everyone, for watching. Uh, that wraps up day 24 in Tubeville, I think. Tubeville? Tubetown? Oh, I forgot the name. Uh, Tubeville. That wraps up this week's Timber and Stone. I will see you all in the next video on Monday, which I am still block recording because my schedule is uncertain, so I'd rather have the episode done than just miss out on it. But by the next one, I I will see what happens. I might let this go an extra day, play through a day without recording because I'm really got a lot of, like I said, terraforming and waiting for stuff to build to do. So thank you for watching. I will see you all next time.